Now, behind those numbers, behind those numbers I just read, are the thousands of families who are helping their loved ones recover, or in some cases, questioning how their symptoms got so bad so quick, resulting in a death. Our Mariah Gallegos shares a story tonight of a nurse who recently died from COVID-19 and how his family is remembering him tonight. I found out he was coming down with something um, mid-July. Initially, James Garcia says he and his family assumed his brother Jason was going to be okay after being diagnosed with the coronavirus. Hey, he's a nurse. He can take care of himself. But once Jason was taken to ICU, things began to go downhill. Jason Garcia, a loving husband and father of two, moved to South Texas in 2006 and became a nurse in 2010, where he served the Coastal Bend community, working on the front lines at Christus Bond Shoreline. He was really my rock since the beginning. Now his family is holding on to their memories from before Jason was hit with COVID-19. He died on August 26, just a few months shy of his 43rd birthday. He uh, will be very much missed. As they continue to read messages from his friends and co-workers, they want to remind people. The virus is real. I, I know everybody says, uh, hey, it's just a virus, uh, but it should really be taken seriously, very seriously. My parents, they're, they're pretty much devastated right now. A son, a dad, a husband, and so many more titles, all of which describe who Jason was. Now, another victim to COVID-19. I still can't believe he's gone. Yeah. Mariah Gallegos, 3 News.